I know. And I know the heavens and the earth will be envious of my beauty today. I know. You can say <laughs> that again. <laughs> Meanwhile, it is my duty to make you beautiful this way. Of course. And you know, I'm just so, so happy. I'm excited that I finally landed the man of my dreams. Oh, I'm so happy for you. Thank you. Think, okay. 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 Um, Susan, let me go. Mm -hmm. Princess, I'm almost done with my makeup. If I'm please can you excuse us? Okay, no problem. I'll like speak to my sister. Alright. Okay. Yeah. What's the problem? So I found out some few things about Kenzie. Um, he got another woman pregnant, so he has his child with her. <sighs> Come on, sis, you're joking me. Uh -uh. Okay, so he has a baby mom, right? Do you know who this person is? Has he ever told you anything? No, come on. Kinsley doesn't have a child. Claire, Kinsley has a child. With who? His cousin. Um, okay, so... Um, he slept with his cousin and got her pregnant and they have a son together. Sis, I know you're joking. Okay, I don't. I want you to assimilate everything in, but for me, for me, it's a no no. Really, this wedding cannot hold because I'm scared. Someone that can sleep with his cousin, I mean, if you have a child with him, he's capable of sleeping with his own child. I'm mean, someone that can't do that, he has that capability. So, I'm suggesting that. The... What are you doing? Steve, you know it's your turn next, right? Oh, no, no, no. Ben is older than I. Shut up. For men, marriage is not done age by age. Oh, really? <laughs> it's done by who finds the right first. Oh, so you're still searching for a wife? Of course. <laughs> hmm. So let me ask you, how about Jennifer? She's not the wife of my children. <laughs> what about Juliet? Ah, that was not out. <laughs> you a bastard. Hey. Don't you dare baby me until you answer my question with all honesty. Hey, what is this? Why didn't you tell me you have a son? Who told you? Did your cousin? Give birth to a son for you or not? Clara, who told you all of that? Can you just shut your trap and answer the damn question? Did you sleep with your cousin and got her pregnant? Oh my god. Oh my god. It's true. Oh Jesus. It's true after all. Let me explain. Hey! Okay. Show your bloody you down your ass! The wedding is here by cancelled! Babe, you don't mean that, do you? Absolutely. Wait, 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 I want you to know that I love you so. If you give me your word, tell me that you're never gonna hurt me. Show Show me that you are
gonna want me Would you show me that you always gonna want me Hold my hand Tell me everything will be just fine Would you show me that you sacrifice Making memories the money can't buy So now I'll be going to the other side Need you to promise that you'll be alright Cause I know what I feel, what I feel for you I just wanted to know Where is she? In her room. Um, is she angry at you? <laughs> Why would she be angry at me? She's meant to be grateful, you know. I just simply told her the truth. What her husband to be did. I mean, she dodged a bullet. Why would evil someone sleep with his cousin? Who does that? God. This is crazy. I actually just got off the phone with Kinsley and he, he, he confirmed it. He has a child with his cousin. But then he said he was a mystic. What kind of mystic is that? Really? Baby? Really? A mistake? Can you sleep with your cousin by mistake? So he said um, he didn't know they were related until she took in for him. And you believe that cock and boo story, right? I'm not supposed to believe. Because I don't. I mean, what kind of excuse is that? How can you even sleep with your cousin and even impregnate? You know what? Typical. Men, they always give excuses, right? Always the work of the devil. Just to sleep with someone other than their wife. Men and excuses. Ah. Wait, 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 wait. So now you're going to turn this into our usual gender war? I beg, I beg. I don't even have that energy, okay? Are you going to console your sister-in-law? Let's go. No. You go, and while you're at it, tell her it was a mistake, as an excuse. Can you not just speak dramatic words? And then can you stop supporting what is wrong? <sighs> Clara! Dinner is ready. Please come downstairs to eat, okay? Please. Clara, normally I won't stop you from crying. Crying will do you more good. At least release the pain. But, at this point, I'll ask you to stop, please. eaten since morning. Please eat. Please. I really am not hungry. Clara, try and eat. No matter how you do. Please. 
And I think you should follow me to the gym tomorrow morning. At least to help take your mind away from this, from these thoughts. Yeah, that's a good idea. It would do you good to follow him to the gym tomorrow. Clara, trust me, we both know how you feel. I know you're hurt. I mean, you loved Kinsley with all your heart and all sincerity and honesty. But what did he do? Did he tell you that? Did he even ever mention it to you? No. He didn't even reciprocate back. Hmm? She's right. He would have had the conversation with you and let you decide. But he didn't do that. Look, he didn't love you. At least for me. He decided to hide something from you. Yes. Look, I know you're hurt. And it would take time to move on. But you have to let things go. You have to move on and pick up the broken pieces of your life and start all over. At least by going out with my husband. Clara, you need the fresh air. And of course, a fresh start. I'm trying. I'm trying, but it hurts so much. Mm -hmm. I want you to know that I love you so. I just want to make this love in my day. Hey, Clara, you still on bed? Good morning. Get up from there. Let's go to the gym. Come on. So yeah. You can't keep staying indoors like this all day. Listen, I understand perfectly well how you feel, but you need to, you need to try to shake it off and, and move on. All right, at least get, get your mind occupied with something else. I really do not feel like going anywhere today. I just want to stay at home. Really? All right, then I'll, I'll see you when I'm back. Just take care, okay? Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Show me that you always gonna want me Would you show me that you always gonna want me Hold my hand Tell me everything will be just fine Would you show me that you sacrifice Making memories the money can't buy <laughs> Hi, baby. Uh huh. Someone is set to work. See my baby. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> Maybe I need to leave before you change my schedule. This your sweet lips. <laughs> well, I wish I could keep you all to myself. No. Oh, well, I'm your husband. You always have me. <laughs> I know. Uh, what about your sister? Have you checked up on her today? Sadly, she's getting worse day by day. I don't know what else to do. I don't even know how to console her anymore. I'm tired. But I would force her out of this house by hook or crook. She has to come out. And that would be with you. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Do you think she would listen to you? I mean, she's been adamant about going out with me. 
can go talk to her. Do you think she'll listen? Come on, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> but you start. Um, okay, I'll start. I'll start. <laughs> <laughs> to lock yourself up in this room. I'm fine. No, you're not. Clara, take a very good look at yourself. I'm sure you didn't even get enough sleep last night. You're gradually becoming an emotional wreck. Why? Because the marriage thing didn't work out between you and Kingsley. I'm fine, I promise. Come with me to the gym. Yes, it will, it will help get your mind away from this ugly place you are at the moment. The gym is not really my thing. Clara, I insist. You have to go with him. I mean, you've been indoors for how long? Two weeks? You don't pick anyone's calls. You barely eat properly. I practically even have to drag you to the sitting room to watch movies with us. Please, you have to do something. If you want to send this to depression, please. I am not depressed. I am. Clara, go change into something and come with me to the gym. I promise you'll be amazed at how fast it worked. Okay, fine. I'll go with you on one condition. Which is. It would just be this once. I wouldn't want you to ask me to go with you tomorrow or next or ever. I mean, that's, that's fine. That's okay. Okay, fine. After today, no one will force you. But you have to promise me one thing. If it works, you have to continue. Okay, I'll just change into something. <laughs> Alright, so um, I'll be waiting for you downstairs. You don't keep me waiting for long. Alright, I'll see you.
You said you would only come with me to the gym once. I changed my mind. Really? All right, let's go. Doing bad at all. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. I'm Desmond, isn't he? I guess you're new around here, right? Kinda. Will I be asking for too much if you don't mind my sticking around you? It depends on what you want to do. Well, <laughs> how about I start with by staring at your beautiful face? <clears throat> okay, I see. You are working okay, okay. How about this? Okay, this is a bit strong. You can't do that too much. No, I want to do
Sigrid? You know, nowadays, when Clara comes back home, she looks chirpy and happy. I must mm. say, I did a really good job. Mm -mm. Not me. I guess it's her new friend. Yeah, she got herself a new friend. And who is that? His name is Desmond, the son of late Chief Chris Okiri. I don't know him. Yeah, he was a rich businessman, a billionaire. And this one is not just his only son, but an only child. So he's the one currently managing all his father's companies. He's actually a really cool guy. Hmm. Yeah. Hello, guys. Hello, Clara. Hi, Clara. Hi, yeah. Sorry, Auntie. <laughs> Where are you going to? <sighs> Dressed like this. It's really not it. Why are you good? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> this one. If you don't know him, I met him at the gym. Uh-uh. <laughs> what? Auntie, you're not going anywhere. It's barely two weeks, right? That you've gotten over a broken relationship. And now you want to jump onto another one. Are you kidding me? No. Come on, sis, I'm fine. No, 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 you're not fine. In fact, let's go. Go to work. Turn around. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Sis, my date is waiting. Oh, no. Take time. And I met him at the gym two days ago. Two days? And you accepted a dinner date from him? Come on, sis. Really? He's cool. He's a nice guy and I like him. You like him or you're using him to heal over Kinsley. He's now a rebound guy, right? You and I know that at this point you don't need a rebound relationship. Sis, this is not a rebound relationship. And I am fine. Says who? Look, my advice, do not have sex with him until every romantic entanglement with Kisley has been dissolved. Sis, mm -hmm. I never told you I was going for a sex party. It's just a dinner date. I know what I'm talking about. I am fine. And I've moved past this old relationship with Kinsley. But isn't this what you've always wanted? In one week. Very classic. Mm. Ten wow, days wait. actually. Ten days. I didn't know you were keeping count though. Your name should be in Guinness Book of Record, don't you think so? Please, please, please. I'm late for my days. I love you. Clara! Hi, Alright, I'll see you in your back. <laughs> Alright. See? Are you serious? You're encouraging her. I believe she's an adult and she needs to be happy. Yeah. You know, my dad died four years ago. And my mom was a lecturer in a university in the UK. So my dad is very wealthy. He has so many businesses everywhere. I mean, everywhere in Nigeria to be specific, across Africa, Europe, you know. Which is why, as only son, I get to manage the businesses and um, it makes me a very busy person, per se. That's why you don't see me at the gym sometimes. I skip them into my routines, the meetings, you know, conference, trips and all. But then again, I made it known to myself that I would never let them down. I would never let my parents down, especially my mom. This was a promise I made since I was a child. And I am glad I... I am glad I kept to my words by the grace of our Creator, you know. And I can proudly say I'm doing an amazing job in managing the businesses. <laughs> Well, from the tone of your voice, one can tell you really love your parents, mm. especially your mom. <laughs> oh, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> yeah, very well. You know, I love my parents so much. Uh, 
I need to ask for any better. You know, they did everything for me to for me to have the best life. They provided me with everything I envisaged that I wanted for myself. So it's only paramount that I return the people by making them proud. Especially my mom holds very much alive. <laughs> wow, that's beautiful. Yeah. So I'm sure you enjoyed the meal, right? Yeah, I did. But I can cook better. Really? Yeah. Awesome. Okay. I can't wait to find out myself, you know. Okay, why don't I come cook for you someday? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, before that day comes, um Will you be my girlfriend? I mean, I... I like you so much. None of the words can actually explain or describe. Um, I don't just want you as a friend. I want something more. something more. So. Um, okay. But please, I would like you to give me some time to think about it. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Take, you know, take, take your time. Um, can I at least, can I ask you one more question? Yeah. Do you like me? <laughs> of course I do. I mean, if I don't like you, I won't be seated here today. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, um, let's, how about you just, you know, let's go to that. <laughs> so chest two. Chest two. Likeness. <laughs> and me waiting. <laughs> yeah. Going for a job interview? No. The job interview is tomorrow. So, <laughs> where are you going to dress like this? For the moment, I'll just go get my toilet Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, wait, Clara, wait. So, why are you in a hurry? So, about this money. So, my husband said he's responsible, mm -hmm. a cool guy, and somewhat rich. Well, mm. I'll tell you more about him. <laughs> come back, okay. oh, come back, time. Yeah. I like this. Uh -huh. mm. uh. Okay, this is a brocade. This is a very nice brocade. You know, we are about entire Christmas. This is a Christmas color. This is beautiful. I love it. You know, I love the last one I got here. Oh, that one? Yes, you yeah, guys are amazing. That is it. Okay. Like this is uh, a double bouquet. Uh, <laughs> uh, oh, this nice. is beautiful. I love yes. it. Oh, my goodness. Clara, I'm glad I met you here today. Babe, please, we need to talk, okay? Why are you stalking me? Babe, I'm not stalking you, okay? But we need to talk, please. I just need your please, audience. Please respect yourself and get the hell out of this place. Babe, please, I promise I'm not going to bore you. I just need to explain. Leave something. here! I do not want to talk to you. I don't have anything to do with you. Don't you understand? Babe, please now. You don't need to be like this. Listen, what happened? Please, can you ask him to leave this place? 
Okay. Hey, please. This is your shop, man. Came to shop. Please, you can just wait for your side. Please. Clara. Hi. I just want to explain everything to you. It's really not what, what it seems. If he doesn't leave, I will leave. Well, please. Please. Listen. Listen. Okay, I think please, it's Please, please, Clara. Oh. Babe, oh. are you okay? What's wrong? What oh. Babe! Oh. Clara! What happened? Clara, what's wrong with you? Clara! Oh. Please help me take care of Please help me take care of Clara! Clara, wake up, Clara. Clara, wake up, please. Clara! A young man, he gave his name as Kingsley. He has called your sister. She's on her way. Kingsley said he fainted before him. Um, yeah. I had spoken to him and, and I... Uh, that's all I could. Do you know that you're pregnant? What? Pregnant? Yeah, you're four weeks pregnant. You are crying. How are we going to figure out a way to solve this matter? Clean, clean. I'm looking at you. Let me tell you. I don't know. Okay, let me tell you what I think we should do. So, I'm thinking maybe you shouldn't tell Kinsley that you're pregnant. Like, you shouldn't know that he's responsible for your pregnancy. How should I say he's responsible for my pregnancy? My child needs a father. I know. Mm, we pin it on Desmond. What? <laughs> At least Desmond is responsible, right? He's a responsible man. He's nice. You don't want a pervert for a father now, do you? Someone like Kinsley? Do you? I'm just suggesting. Hmm? did it. 
Hope you didn't allow him his protection. <sighs> he didn't even try using any. Great. Why are you looking all worried? Ah, sis. Are you sure this is right? Yes. Yeah. Okay, I can I can confirm that over um, Fiber Max Large. Oh. Okay, yes, yes, the 30 Mbps. Checked. Okay, that's a low. One for 30 Mbps. Okay, confirm. So how about the um, the one that I assigned to you, to your company to afford? Oh, okay, I'll check for you. Hey. Okay, you know what, can I, can I call you back? Yeah, thank you. Hey, it's been out. Sorry, walk. How are you? You look pale. What's up? What's the problem? Hey. You know you can always talk to me. What's the problem? Come on, babe. Come. What's the problem? Babe. I am pregnant. Is the pregnancy funny? Shouldn't be moody. Yes, you know, we should be celebrating actually. I am here for you. If the pregnancy is for me, then we should be celebrating. Of course, you have nothing to worry about. Okay. Yeah, you shouldn't look moody. Come on, I'm here for you, okay? Hmm? Smile for me. Come on. It's not a family. You should be happy. No. That huge smile, the light smile when I first met you. Yeah, that's all I did. This calls for celebration, okay? protect this pregnancy with everything I have got. Oh, thank goodness it's happening like this. Now I am going to make mama proud. I never give her a reason to feel bad for having me alone as her only child. Yes. Guess what? <laughs> oh god. As you can see, I'm working, right? Oh, come on, just guess. Sarah, please, can you stop distracting me? Please, I have work to do. I told this one about the pregnancy. So, what did he do? Nothing. He said nothing. He thought the pregnancy is easy. He accepted the pregnancy? Yes. That's good. Do you not surprise? Oh, Clara, Jesus. I'm not. Can I work? It's good news for you now, is it not? You don't sound excited. Clara, I'm just distracted with work. Okay. Fine. I'm happy for you. At least that's what you wanted, right? Now you're talking. Thank you. Thank you for the idea. You're welcome. <laughs> Wanting to know that I love you so. I just wanna make this love in my head. 
I just want to know if you are worthy I gave you all my soul If you give me your word Tell me that you're never gonna hurt me Show me that you always gonna want me Oh yeah, I need to stop by the office before dropping you off, okay, hope you don't mind. Ah, uh, it's fine. Hi, Clara. Yeah, it's me, Kingsley. Listen, I just want to ask you a simple question, okay? Does your new boyfriend know that you are pregnant for me with my baby? Um, sorry, wrong number. Huh? Sorry, that was your wrong number. Oh, I usually get this type of calls sometimes. So it's one of those things. You know, our size and calling wrong number are like five and six. Exactly. <laughs> Where I just get caller doesn't call again because I'll see something he doesn't like. Mm -hmm. Doesn't go to that extent. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be annoying. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. I want you to know that I love you so. I just wanna make this love and worth it. I just want to know if you are worthy. I gave you all my soul. If you give me your word, tell me that hey, you're Hey, baby. Gonna... I'm glad you came. I have come here to hear the nonsense that you're talking about. How are you doing? Do not patronize me. How dare you say that I'm pregnant for you? Is that madness or something? Babe, I know that you're pregnant for me, okay? I know that you're four weeks pregnant for me, and that baby is mine. You are sick in the head. Who told you that I am pregnant? Oh, please spare me that bullshit. Clara, the doctor told me that you're four weeks pregnant for me, okay? And it's been barely four weeks since you called off our marriage. And four weeks ago, we were still together. So if I still know my maths, that baby is mine. So I suggest you speak to me more mildly, okay? I will talk to you the way I deem fit because you deserve it. What is wrong with you? How dare you say that I'm pregnant for you? But come to think of it, even if I'm pregnant, are you the only man in this town? <laughs> oh, please, Clara, come on. We both know that I've been the only man in your life. So what are you talking about? Kinsley, I do not know what you are talking about, but just know that you are not responsible for my pregnancy. Mm. You don't know what I'm talking about, huh? Yes. And I'm not responsible for your pregnancy. All right, you know what? To make it easier for everyone, we could just do a DNA test and know if I'm the father of the baby that you're carrying or not. Yeah? Just go and look for who is carrying your child, not him. Come on, get out! Babe! Clara, you know I still love you, right? I still love you. Maybe this is a sign that we should be together, that we should... I want you to know <sighs> that I love you so I just want to make this love and worth it I just want to know if you are worthy I gave you all my soul Clara. If you give me your word Tell you me that you're not gonna hurt me Why is your face like that? He knows Kingsley knows about the pregnancy Who told him? He claims the doctor told him Remember, he was the one who took me to that hospital. And I'm sure he knows a lot of people there. <sighs> what did you tell him? Of course, I told him the pregnancy is not his. Good. But he says DNA will settle everything. Uh -uh. 
No way, Diane and Eleni is mad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for that. Are you fine? We'll handle know. it. We'll handle it. Clara, I've been thinking. Why don't we try and get rid of Kinsley for good? How do you mean get rid of Kinsley? Like, kill him, that's what I mean. What? How? Sis. What? No, please, I can't. Um, okay. Then get ready to say bye bye to Desmond. Because as long as Kinsley is in your path, you can have Desmond. Guy, which kind of game won't come with this one again? How you really compare these two, these, these two leagues? Eh? How can you be comparing Premier League and La Liga? How? Okay, how many world class players did, did this uh, Premier League? They're plenty now. I named them. No, name them. Let me. I've been named over 20 of them. Uh -huh. who, okay, who will win the last Champions League trophy for, for England? Do you know how many times Real Madrid have won this cup? You my know, friend. my friend, my, my guy, see, pass La Liga. He's who? He's who? What's up, King? <laughs> no, you don't look good, man. But we don't go here. We sit here on one bottle. Absolutely. Now your guys would be full of stock now. Guy, what's going on? do everything for you. The sooner you take Kinsley out, the better for you. And you end up with Desmond. Come on, sis. I can't stain my hands with blood. And I don't think I can live with that guilt for the rest of my life. Clara, please, don't be a weakling. Ah. Sis, what if I get caught while at it? Well, it depends on who and how it's done. I don't think I can do it. Yeah. Okay, just say bye bye to Desmond because you will not end up with him. Yes. <clears throat> hi, hi, baby. Mm -hmm. How are you? Mm -hmm. Hi, Clara. Hi. What's wrong? This life is full of vanity. Baby, why would you say something like that? Kinsley's dead. What? Wait, wait. <laughs> Which Kinsley? The Kinsley we all know. Clara's ex. <laughs> you mean Kinsley? Wait, 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 wait. Kinsley. <clears throat> what happened to him? Yes, he, he was knocked down by a vehicle today. His body has been deposited to the morgue.
Tori, what was that? What is that look down for? What is that look for? What? Why are you staring at me like that? As if I had a hand in his death, I beg. I was just wondering how come he got knocked by a car the same day you asked me to kill him? Simple. Coincidence. Yes, nothing more than that. Mm. Look, nature had our cry and acted accordingly. That's it. I never wished him death. I did. At least it's out of the way. You can now end up with Desmond. You should be happy. Did you really hate him that much? Yes. Who are you? My name is Zoe. Sorry, have we met before? Not to worry. You will hear from me soon. Clara. <laughs> Sets my eyes at you. I saw her bold, confident, resilient lady who's willing to fight any obstacles that comes before her. Please, my support. 
support system, my confidence. Me home. Please. Clara. Will you marry me? I'm already at the restaurant. Hurry up and wait soon. <laughs> Whatever. Not to go. <sighs> To guess what? Yeah, I've started already. You know, I'm not good with guess what. Come now, on, just this once. Okay. It's not my birthday. Mm -hmm. It's not your birthday. Mm -hmm. It's not my husband's birthday or anniversary. Mm -hmm. Oh, you found out the gender of the baby. Uh, no. Come on, sis. <laughs> See, are you going to come out with her or not? Can you just try? I'm not good with guess what? You already know that. I want you to know <laughs> Wait, that I love you so. I just want to make this love last. Are you serious? <laughs> I just want to yes, know if you are. <laughs> I give you all my soul. Like, I am. Um, if you give me your word. I know, right? <laughs> So, <clears throat> what do I call you? Okay, I am mm -hmm. the new mm -hmm. Mrs. Mm -hmm. Clara mm -hmm. Desmond mm -hmm. Ijele. Mm. At your service. <laughs> Oh, this is so beautiful. Thank you, sister. Thank you. We should celebrate. Tell me everything will be just fine. Would you show me that you sacrifice? Making memories the money can't buy. So now I'll be going to the other side. Need you to promise that you'll be alright. Cause I know what I feel, what I feel for you. I just wanted to know. Show me that you always gonna want me Would you show me that you always gonna want me Hello, good morning. Hello, it's Zoe. Zoe from where? Okay, the lady that accosted you some time ago at the supermarket and told you she's going to get back to you. 
Oh, yeah, I think I remember that incident. How may I help you, please? Actually, I'm Kinsley's cousin and his baby mama. I learned that you called off the wedding because of me. Listen, I really do not have that time to talk about Kinsley right now. So please, he's he straight to me now. Clara, what if I tell you that I knew he got you pregnant before he died? The baby you gave to your husband is Kinsley's child. Can you just stop saying nonsense and get the hell out of my phone? <laughs> Kinsley told me about everything two days before he died. Five million naira and I'll keep my mouth shut. Else, the whole world will know about your little secret. Including your husband, Desmond. And yes, I have all the evidence at my disposal. Think about it and call me later. Okay? You have a new friend. <laughs> Bye! What? Pick up the call, pick up the call. Ah, no, this woman, not now. Hey, Clara. Hello, sis. Sis, there's a problem. What happened? No, sis, this is not something we, we can talk about the phone. Please, where are you? I'm at home, I'm not about to step out. What's up? Sis, this is not something we can talk about the phone. Can you just please just hold on for me? What happened? Are you okay? Is everything fine? Is someone after your life? Talk to me now. No, no, sis, please just hold on. Hold on. Oh, hold on. I'm coming. I'm coming right quick. Okay, fine. Hurry, hurry, hurry. She's demanding a whooping sum of five million naira. Five! Five million naira! Where do I get that from? Okay, but you know that if you give her five million naira, she'll come back asking for more, right? That's my fear! Blackmailers never stop until you stop them. At this point, since I really do not want to lose my marriage. But wait, what evidence does she have on you? I don't know! Evidence or no evidence, I do not want a mention of this into my husband's ears. So you want to give her the five million air? What? Eh, that's how you sound now. Do you? What if you help me stop her? Eh? You say? Oh, sorry. <laughs> what do you mean stop her? I mean... The way you stopped Kinsley. Oh my God. Clara, for the last time, I did not kill Kinsley. It was a hit and run. And you know it. Jesus Christ. You are my sister. Why would you not even believe me? I don't have a hand in his death. Why? God. You're unbelievable. Jeez. In this bus, we're riding, riding. I don't even know where we're going. Don't know. As long as you're here, girl, oh, girl. I'll be alright. Yeah. As long as I'm by you, yeah. I'll be okay. I'll be I know okay. it's crazy, but I'm My think... looks so beautiful in this. Look at the cuts and everything about it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I love it. That's very nice. <laughs> this is rich on two bites. Yeah. <laughs> this is lovely. So look Can at I this see too. another? Okay, I uh, I don't think I like this one, but it's it's nice. Okay. Can I 
don't know about this. But this is hard. Okay. Um, sorry, excuse me. Hello? Clara, I'm standing a stone throw away from your husband right now. Are you paying the five million naira, or should I go to him and spill the beans? No, 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 please just hold on. Hold on, hold on, please. I beg you in the name of God, please do not say a word to my husband, please. Okay, it's fine. I will pay you the money. Just give me two days. Good. You have three days. I am that guy. <sighs> my goodness. Look, Zoe, I, I really do not want to see you or hear from you ever again. Did you get that? Granted. Five million naira and I will disappear forever from your life. Hates you so much. The feeling is mutual, babe. <sighs> Babe, is anything the matter? Babe, what's wrong? Babe! something for Mary. Go and meet your husband. Ask him what the problem is. Don't admit to anything. Don't say anything that will be to me. Come on, man. Huh? Don't say anything till I get there. Ah, oh, it's simple. Why did you lie? Lie? Yes. How? Before leaving for work this morning, I asked you if you were going to leave this house. You said no. But whereas you did quite the opposite. You did leave this house immediately I left. Why? Explain. Um, uh, I'm sorry, babe. I... I went to see Sister Bella and... She told me my uncle was around and I needed to join them for the meeting. I'm sorry I didn't call you. Uh, it's only repeat it's all again.
So why why are you back? Oh yeah, I actually forgot this. You know, I have to realize the contract with the agency. So, and this is the original copy. Without this, we can't receive a finalized deal. Oh, okay. Thank you. 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 Thank don't take this out. I want to see it when you return. <clears throat> so I'll go to the office and everybody keeps saying. Of course, tell them your wife did that. <laughs> Come on, of course. You make me my favorite wife today, okay? Of course I will. I love you. I love you more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't take it out. <laughs> I'll see you. Okay, I'll see you. Bye. Okay, baby. Love you. Yeah, be safe. Yeah, sure. I'll be with you too. Yeah. <sighs> Sis, you really do not have to worry yourself anymore. It's not what I thought it was. <sighs> yes. Okay, I'll give you a heads up. Okay. All right, bye. Oh. <sighs> that was close. I finally paid the back mail the money. How did you raise the money? I cleared my account. I had about 3.5 million in my account, so I asked my husband to give me 1.5 million. And he gave me without asking what I want to use the money for. Hmm. Mm, okay. But at least that idiot is gone for good for her, right? Huh? Uh -huh. I thought that if she should come back for more, I would kill her. This time around, I'm not joking. I will. But on a more serious note, did you? How did you send the money? Did you give her cash, bank transfer? What? No, it was true. Bank transfer. She didn't want cash. I think we do. At least you have a rich husband that sends one million without asking. Mm. Your brother-in-law, five hundred naira. Ah. He must know what I want to use it for. I know. I know. By the way. Hi, is my baby. Uh, not you. We kicking. <laughs> <sighs> the inability to conceive is getting to your brother now. And it's affecting me also. I understand. But there are other options. Why don't you guys try adopting a child? Well, that's one option, but I I don't even know how to present it to your brother. You know? I can't. Because he has told me he wants his own child and I must conceive and bear his children. I know. But the thing is that it's taking forever. It's just taking forever for me to conceive. Don't worry. You will conceive. I hope so. Just pray. Okay? <sighs> sure.
Just easy, 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 easy. Sorry, sorry, no. I love you, okay? I love you. Hey, listen, 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 is everything okay? Yes, all I can say is that your wife and child are doing very much okay. And the doctor will be seeing you in a while. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay, thank you. No thank you, yes. Thank you. Yes! you said was looking for me. Oh, no, she's outside. I thought I asked you to tell her to wait for me here. <gasps> Madam, she refused to come inside. She said she would rather wait for you outside. It's fine. Just go back to your tree. Thank you. Hey, you? Mm-hmm. What the hell are you doing here? First of congratulations on your baby boy. He must be two years old by now, right? Stop wasting my time, you fellow. What brings you to my house? 20 million naira. Is that the name of your madness or what? 20 million naira or the old world will know who the biological father of your son is. Get out of my house and never show your face here again. <laughs> I give you four days. Four days to pay me my money. Else, I will sing. <laughs> I will sing. I know. Leave my house. I will send you my bank details later. Say me hi to your lovely husband. <laughs> Get out. Hello, sis. She's back again. Who's back again? The blackmailer. What? Yes. She's asking for 20 million naira. 20? Where do I get such an amount of money from? Are you serious? 20 million? Is she crazy? <laughs> Can you imagine? She said I have four days to pay the money. Four days. How do I do that? Wait, but I thought you said she's not going to come back again, that you had settled her. Why is she back? So she said, look sis, I really do not want to lose my marriage. This man means everything to me. Look here, at this point, I just feel like strangulating that girl. <sighs> okay, you know what? Um, can we see tomorrow? I will, I will sleep over it. I will think of something. Maybe come up with an idea or something. I don't know. But you're not paying that 20 million naira. Like, is she okay? <sighs> Calm down, okay?
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You said this nearly. That's the way to mm-hmm. test your own. <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. You remind me. Who's Zoe? <coughs> Sorry, 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 sorry. Drink some drink with her. Sorry, sorry. Come here. So sorry, okay? Uh, um. Are you sure you're okay? I'm fine now. Thank you. Why is that a look of fear on your face? Hmm? Fear? Yeah. Um, oh no. I'm fine. You sure? Yeah. <clears throat> anyway, a lady called you the other day. She said her name was Zoe. And she's your friend. Uh, Everyone calls anyone friend. Zoe and I are not friends. I, I just know her. That's all. Mm. She thinks you guys are friends. Anyway, she said I should just extend my greetings to you and our child. Um. Okay. Is that all she said to you? Mm, yeah. She also said um. That she said what? Hmm. What I heard something there. She said, "Do you know my son connection?" Oh. Did she tell you how she got your contact? Hey, come on. I told her she's your friend, so probably she must have gotten my number from you or something. Right? Mm. Are you sure you're okay? <laughs> yes, we are fine. Hello. Hello, Clara. I hope you got my message from your husband last night. What is it? The next time I will call your husband again, it will be revelation time. Do not call my husband. Do not try it. 20 million naira. Where do you expect me to get such an amount of money from? And what's the guarantee that if I give you the money, you won't come back for more? I will not come back again, darling. 20 million naira and I will disappear forever. Exactly the same thing you said the last time. Now you're back again. Do not waste my time. 20 million naira or the whole world will know. God, please take her out of my life like you took away Kinsley. She's a thorn in my flesh. Please, God, punish her with instant death. tears in your eyes. Uh, yeah, it's it's tears of joy. You know, you know you can always talk to me. (sighs) 
maybe. I wonder what my life would have been without you in it. Thank you for loving me this much. Thank you so much. Lots of money while you were dancing with my lovely friend, your beautiful wife. Are you serious? Good to see you. you look good, sir. Oh, Sylvia, don't join me, please. I think it was an oversight, you know, due to many people at the wedding. I, I didn't know. get to catch your face. I know. I I'm so serious, the phone of this place. It's fine. I didn't expect you to recognize everybody that attended your wedding. Exactly. <laughs> you know, the excitement. Yeah, yes, you look good, sir. You look ah, good. Thank you. You too. I can see for you. Oh, here comes our beautiful wife. Mm -hmm. Clara Sitka cool. International! Zoe. Clara, my God! Zoe Worldwide! Timba and Caliba! Ah, good to see you! Uh, I'll leave you to this. Oh. Uh, my dear, you're looking so pretty! You're not looking so pretty! What are you doing here? Come here. <laughs> Just go over you. <laughs> I'm testing the waters. Shut up and get out of my house. <laughs> Shut up and get out of my house. Do you have my money ready? Look at your voice, bitch. Okay, is my money ready? 20 million naira is a whole lot of money, don't you get it? Oh, stop that crap. You're swimming in millions, baby. Please, I need my money. Just look at how you're asking me money as if I owe you money. Oh, you don't owe? Okay, let me go and meet you. Hey, husband. get out. When I have your money, I will send it to you. Leave. Four days. Four days is your timeline. Helps. My dear Clara. Get out. <laughs> Clara Secret International. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that. Oh, playfully. It's not as serious. Yeah. You said you wanted to eat something, right? Okay, I'll just go fix something for you to eat. You okay, right? Yeah, sure. Okay. You mean you want to give that bitch a whooping sum of 20 million now? Clara, are you serious? What would you have me do, sis? Clara, that is crazy! Really? I have to do this to save my marriage. You know this will not be the end, right? What if she comes for more? And to be 50? What then? I, I don't know. I really do not care. Clara, what you need to do is to put that bitch six feet below. That's what you're supposed to do. Sis, at this point, I do not mind. I really do not mind doing anything stupid right now. Okay, how do you want to raise 20 million now? Maybe I'll just call her and beg her to give me some time to strategize, right? 
and puts her for good, right? And her? Not to give her money. Clara, I have my eyes on you. <laughs> right now, I know that you wish me that. But just a quick reminder that I'm not dying anytime soon. And if you try to quicken my exit from this world, you will have yourself to blame for it. Let me know when my money is ready. I repeat, let me know when my money is ready, Clara. Welcome. Um, Isola, where is my son? Um, he's in the room, sleeping. Okay. Um, uh, please, why don't you just help me check on him to know if he's lying down properly? Okay, ma'am. You're stealing from me. No. No, no. No, babe. I'm not stealing from you. Will you shut up? I just caught you red handed. Stealing from me. No, 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 babe. I'm and you're not, lying? I'm not lying to you. Babe. How dare you? Don't, don't you dare lie to me. Babe, I'm not lying to you. I didn't steal your money. Just. Oh, no, babe. I'm So explain this. What's this? You're not saying. Then, then what's what's this? What are you doing with my money? You can explain what? So which means this is who you are. No, babe, no. How do I get how do I get married to you? Babe, it's not what you think. It means if you can steal from me, you can kill me. No, no, what? No. Babe, why would you think that? Why would I think that? I don't trust. I don't know who you are anymore. No, babe, please, babe, can you just please just allow me explain? Explain please. what exactly? You think I I can't. I, I can't, I can't do this. I can't continue with babe, this. Babe, babe, please. I wasn't stealing from you. Come, come. I wasn't stealing from you, babe. Babe, please. Can you just please allow me explain this once? Babe, please. It's not what you think. Please. Can't. Just let me explain. I can't. Don't, don't, don't you even dare come close to me. Babe, please. You, babe, babe. Come get, 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 get out. Don't babe, even please, touch I me. You. I wasn't stealing babe. your money, babe. Babe! Babe! Babe, babe. Babe, babe please. Babe, please, I beg you, babe. Babe, please, I beg you, I don't know what to do. Babe, 
this up. Please, I don't know what came over me. Please, please, I beg you. Please, I don't know what came over me. Please, please, I beg you. Please, I don't know what came over me. Please, please, I beg you. Please, I don't know what came over me. Please, please, I beg you. Please, I don't know what came over me. Please, please, I beg you. Please, I don't know what came over me. Please, please, I beg you. Please, I don't know what came over me. Please, please, I beg you. Please, I don't know what came over me. Please, please, I beg you. Please, I don't know what came over me. Please, please, I beg you. 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 Please, please,
me. Just kill me. Do anything you want to do to people, please. I deserve it. Please, just, just shout at me. Do something. Kill me if you want. Just do anything. I won't touch you. I won't do anything to you. I knew from the onset that I wasn't the biological father. the secret or put your shame open to you for lying to me and lose you. Option two was to keep the secret. I still have you by my side with a bonus baby. Yes, because a bonus baby will be in my favor. And my mom especially, who has always wanted a son to get married and give a child or grandchild or grandchildren. And so I couldn't stand telling my mom that our only child, our only son, cannot reproduce, or that I'm important. To break her heart. To hurt her so much. Being the only person that I have left in my family, I can't afford to lose my mom. Do that to her. So I went with option two. Just to keep the secret. Still have you by my side. And the baby. To cover my shame. So I went with your cards. I played along. I guess I played the game so well that I outplayed you. I am sorry. I didn't say anything. 
you knew all this while and didn't see anything. And here I am living in fear should you find out. So he was blackmailing me. First, so he requested five million naira, which I gave to her two years ago. And now she's asking for 20 million now, which is the reason I tried stealing your money. Gosh, I feel so glad. This one, I don't even know you anymore. I don't even recognize you. And here I am trying to. Just because. I knew somehow someone would come for the pregnancy. The biological father. So I was waiting for the moment. I don't want to lose you. Call the child. I went as far as listening to your every conversations, your calls, your text messages, your charts. I tracked everything. Knowing that somehow I'll find a clue. Until that very moment where you say answering some suspicious calls. Then I would ask you, you'll tell me it's just wrong numbers and all of that. I knew they were all lies upon lies upon lies. Regardless, I played along. Because I had a target. I was dying to see his face. I was dying to meet him. So then I waited. I waited for that. For that very moment. Do not patronize me. How dare you say that I'm pregnant for you? Is that madness or something? Babe, I know that you're pregnant for me, okay? I know that you're four weeks pregnant for me, and that baby is my... You are sick in the head! Who told you that I am pregnant? Oh, please spare me that bullshit! Clara, the doctor told me that you're four weeks pregnant for me, okay? And it's been barely four weeks since you called off our marriage. And four weeks ago, we were still together. So if I still know my maths, that baby is mine. So I suggest you speak to me more mildly, okay? I will talk to you the way I deem fit. Because you deserve it. What is wrong with you? How dare you say that I'm pregnant for you? What come to think of it? Even if I'm pregnant, are you the only man in this town? <laughs> oh, please, Clara, come on. We both know that I've been the only man in your life. So what are you talking about? Kinsley, I do not know what you are talking about. But just know that you are not responsible for my pregnancy. Hmm. You don't know what I'm talking about, huh? Yes. And I'm not responsible for your pregnancy. All right, you know what? To make it easier for everyone, we could just do a DNA test and know if I'm the father of the baby that you're carrying or not. Simple. I suspected it was your ex. The man I was looking for that you just broke up with. And he's most likely the father of your unborn. Our unborn child. So I had to do something. I had to act fast. 
will look for the best possible way to take him out. And who's that? I come on, I said the Zoe lady should not come back here again. How else? Are you Mr. Desmond? Yes, please. You're under arrest for the murder of one Mr. Kensley Amani. Um, what's going on here, officer? Um, I, I don't know him. I don't know any Kensley. I, I, I don't know what you're talking about or who you're talking about. To be honest. Uh, I'm at a look my side now. Ah. Uh, so you won't call it deny me now for my phone. What do you do like this now? God. Ah. But I don't show you. Normally, you don't find the man. You find him normally. You do him clean. But as it be like this now, you know, say, after that, you say, confirm him, say, that dope work. But it be like, say, get on EP, where did he, you know, where did he see? So, like, be do all the way. I don't know. I like I said, the, the person gather our info for our car, so nah, you don't send that you proper way, kind of from here. So, so, nah, so it be so, you know, go to nice, say, you know, no, you don't do the job, but as it be now, you go take out like that. But the evidence. The um, um, officer, please, I, I don't know this man. I don't know what he's, he's talking about. I've never met him before in my entire life. You have to believe me. To be very honest, I am telling you the gospel truth. I mean, they tell you, say, evidence, day, boss, he day. What they do like even in the account days where you know say I know they do Bitcoin. The price that are there, everything dead there. About no no do this kind of thing. Is this true? Sir? Yes. So this month, you have every right to remain silent. Anything you do or say will be used against you in court of law. I said move! Move. Okay, okay. You? No. Move! So you killed this? I'll shoot you. Move! Yes, no. But technically, no. I, 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 I don't think what was necessary. I was trying to protect you. Yes, no! No, no, no. I... Jesus! Oh my God! Oh, Jesus! Oh, no! Desmond, what happened? It was Desmond. I don't understand. It was him. He killed Kinsley. Desmond killed Kinsley. Hey! 